Hello coaches, in this Blue Golf tutorial we are going to go over how to input your players into groups in Blue Golf. So this is the step that you're going to have to do after a, each coach in the match has added their players uh, successfully to that match. What you then have to do is actually add the players to groups before you can input their scores. So first step, go to bluegolf.com and this will be the Blue Golf home screen will, will pull up here and then once the Blue Golf home screen pulls up you are going to click sign in up here in the top right hand corner so go ahead and click there then this screen is going to pop up you're going to go ahead and sign in with your ID and password if you don't have your ID and password or, or you have lost it or not sure what it is contact us and we will be sure to get that to you so go ahead and sign in you're not going to have to worry about this page. You will automatically be routed to your Blue Golf Rounds page. So once you've signed in, your Blue Golf home screen pulls up. Again, we're just trying to, we're only going to be worried about this icon right here, the Rounds icon. That's the only icon you'll have to worry about throughout the year. So go ahead and once you've logged in, click on Rounds. Then your schedule is going to pull up. Once your schedule pulls up, you'll notice a lot of dates for this example. We're in February. If you want to toggle between the months, you can use these arrows up here March April so that's how you toggle between months um, so for this example we're looking for this date on February 19th so any date on your calendar that is highlighted in gray is a date where you have a match scheduled so go ahead and click on the the date of your match then once you do that the match will pull up and you will want to go down here and actually click on the match. So once you click on the match you are taken to the matches home screen. You'll notice that the golfers have already been added. It's very important that you have to add the golfers before you can put the golfers into groups. So we've already, this is a boys match so two teams, five golfers are playing for each team so ten total golfers. All ten golfers have been added to the match. Now we're going to add those golfers to groups. So to do this, go ahead and see where it says groups there. Go ahead and click that. Then this screen will, will pull up and we want to click assign. Once we click assign, the easiest way to add golfers to groups is the drag and drop method. So go ahead and click on drag and drop. All right, and so here you'll see the three tee times. The match starts at 3.30. They're going in off in 10 minute increments. So that's what these boxes are, and then over to the left are the 10 golfers who are in the match. So for that first time, you know, say Allen was going to be playing with Morris from Bellevue, so go ahead and click Allen, hold it down, drag down to the 3.30 time, then go over and click on Morris, keep it held down, and drag Morris down to 3.30. Okay, you're just going to do that for each time slot. So Aaron is going to be playing with Barton as well as Grayson and Xander. So again, I'm just clicking on the player, holding it down, and then dragging it into the appropriate box with that player's starting time. Okay, so that's all we're doing. We're just dragging and dropping into the appropriate boxes, and we're doing that until there's no names left over here in this column. So you know you're done dragging and dropping and pairing your players when all the players have been moved from this column into one of these starting time boxes. Once you have done or dragged and dropped all the players into the appropriate starting times, all you have to do then is click save. Once you click save, you'll notice that all the groups have been set up. So you can just click back there, back again, and then you are Back to your matches home screen, now all of a sudden you have where it says groups, you have 10 golfers in three groups. Once you've done that, you are all set. Your players have been added to the matches as well as added to the groups, and then you are ready to insert the scores for the match. So that's how you add the players to the groups. If you have any questions, please feel free to let us know. Call us, email us, whatever is easiest for you. We are here to answer any questions you may have. Thanks, and let us know if you have any questions.